I wanted to just be able to help teach the next generation of makers. I love connecting with different students from all over the world. I like uh, being able to teach um, something that took me so long to, to learn. I like just connecting and hearing other people's stories and where they came from and why they're getting into it. People come to class from all walks of life, going through many different things in their lives. And I'm blessed to be able to um, facilitate creativity or open up blockages that they might be experiencing mentally. I feel like the students are the best part about teaching the classes. You get to meet a lot of cool people, you connect. It's really easy to bond over something that everyone's into and then it really is like a little community, a little family, everyone stays in touch. It's an extremely tough time in the world, more so now than ever, and it's important to stay creative and physically making something or doing something healthy, selfish for yourself. The classes are smaller, they're more intimate, so on a positive note, it, it, it allows for us to be more focused on the individual students. First day here was just, I was just excited to be here and it was a lot of fun, man. I, I just really, really enjoyed being here and was just excited to see this final product, man. I mean, this is amazing, amazing. You know, the classes have, you know, started about the shoe and the shoe's what gets everyone in the same room. And at the same time, it's more than just the shoe. It's, they're learning from us and at the same time, we're learning from them. And I'm an international student from uh, Rangoon, Burma. Burma is a third world country and it's coming up right now and I feel like the country is really in our generation's hands to actually push it forward. So for me to like learn skills like this in a developed country and everything, I might be able to go back and actually give back you know, to the community who's interested in these kind of things. Again, it's not always about the shoe. Um, it's about people coming together. Uh, it was my son's because he heard about it first. And he said, Dad, we need to take this class. So I called my dad, I was like, Dad, like, we gotta go do this. And, and he was down, of course. So. I wanna do another class with my granddaughter. Awesome. She's a sneak ahead herself, so. I'm from Colombia. So, like, being here, it's something special because it's the first time I'm seeing other people besides my family. Inspiring me is definitely uh, the people who we lost this year because uh, there was like a lot of tragic moments this year and I just wanted to dedicate it to those that we lost early. I'm constantly inspired by the students. Some of the ideas that they come up with, some of their stories, where they come from, what they did to get here to be able to take this class and be with us, constantly inspired. So for me, the whole process of from A to Z, you know, I've enjoyed, I've hung on every word. I probably took the best notes I've ever took in my entire life. The faster you learn the process, the faster you're gonna become great on any other design or thing that you make. I think it's important, especially during this time, that you are continuing to move forward and you're putting yourself in in an uncomfortable situation to learn something and grow. 2021, the classes, I'm looking forward to all the new silhouettes. I'm looking for, forward to the new students, networking. We have an Air Max class in there. We're gonna have new ones that I don't think I'm allowed to say. I really wanna thank you know, the, the media team for you know, helping capture this, help, help capturing these moments and you know, this experience so it can help us in a time to remember what we just went through because sometimes we're going to forget.